I love the racing community. God has given a, uh, a gift, I'd say, uh, to minister to the community through my original passion of racing many years ago. Uh, and then after I became a believer, I ended up uh, being able to lay that down, get equipped for ministry, and then it came back together in 06 when I started to become a, a chaplain in the racing community. My passion has been to uh, encourage everyone to find out why they believe what they believe and this is one of the incredible communities that we've been given favor to do that. Since uh, Ray came on board, it, it pretty much uh, took a, a more special meaning for all of us. Me more, more than many, I think, because uh, it kind of turned, turned my focus around going back to, to the Lord and things like that. And I see day to day what, what Ray does for our riders and staff and as far as motor racing outreach goes, if they're all like Ray is, you know, they're a pretty special group. To have right here in my life is, uh, it, it's huge. Uh, he's, you know, what he brings to the table every day that we're here on the racetrack and stuff to, you know, give us that extra support, you know, from up above, you know, and our connection coming through that, it's just, it's, it's really been amazing. Um, he's, every time we're here, you know, it's like you're out on the racetrack and you feel like you got two angels flying with you, you know, to keep you safe. And, and so far with my racing career, you know, I've, I've stayed safe, you know, so it's, you know, having him here and being with us and, you know, it's, it, it means a lot. Ray has been there to, you know, to be my supporter, always. Um, he, uh, he always has a positive attitude, he always gives prayer, um, he, always, he always looks out for us, and um, yeah, I, I really don't know where the sport would be without somebody like Ray. definitely essential to the weekend. It's something that we look forward to. And I couldn't possibly see racing or having a difficult weekend, whether it's crash or something personal, not having him around. It's, it's, in my opinion, like critical to what we need here and what the positive energy that he brings to the track. ministry is provided by the free will gifts of those that, that have the opportunity to give. One of the things that we're trying to do, we've created a pit crew, prayer, invest, and team. The prayer investing team is what we have uh, and we're looking for people to join with us with that. We're not supported by the AMA or MRO or the other organizations that we serve, so we basically try to reach outside the community and in our, in our church and home uh, and ask them for support uh, to keep us out in, in front of uh, all the, the people that we minister to. So our request ultimately is to uh, to the listeners, to the viewers, to please uh, consider supporting us.